Hello, Josh Stevens here, Head Geek at SolarWinds. Today I'm going to walk you through the new WMI Monitor, a free tool from SolarWinds.com. The WMI Monitor is a great application to use to monitor a Windows server or even a Windows workstation, any Windows box that supports WMI. Let me show you how it works. When you first start the WMI Monitor, you'll be prompted with a wizard. Now the wizard will walk you through how to set up the WMI Monitor and begin monitoring devices on your network. The first thing you want to do is choose Next and then enter in the name or IP address of the server that you want to monitor. Now I'm going to enter in my localhost IP address or my loopback address. If you wanted to monitor a remote server that would then prompt you for credential information, which means the logged in information that the application will use to pull the stats back from the server or usually an administrator level account. I'm going to simply hit next and now it asks me what types of things I want to monitor. Now the WMI monitor ships with several pre-configured sets of monitoring capabilities or you can browse and choose them from the SolarWinds community at thewack.com, or you can create your own. Let's go ahead and do that now. Now what I'm using is the built-in WMI browser within the WMI monitor application. It's a great little WMI browser. I use it quite a bit. You should definitely check it out. I'm going to go ahead and choose only the formatted performance counters within WMI. And let's go ahead and go down to, uh, let's see here, to process. And let's choose the total. And let's go ahead and grab just a couple of these that we think will probably change a lot and show us some good data. Let's grab handle count and let's go ahead now and grab the thread count and simply choose next. Now at that point you can go ahead and hit the start monitoring button and the WMI monitor will then start collecting data and showing it on the screen to give you an easy way of telling where you have problems on the network with these specific application servers. You can also click the settings button to go back and modify these by clicking on the pencil mark. Let me show you how that works. I'm going to click the pencil and I'm going to go in and change the name to something a little more useful. And I'm going to now set thresholds. Now thresholds are useful if I want to have the, the items on the display change color based upon a variable or a status. So let's go ahead and change this to 100 and that one to 1000. And let's go ahead and make the name versus browse template Josh's um, process stuff. And hit OK. And now you'll see that it's red because the, the thresholds for these values are, be, are below um, what I said is the critical threshold. Now, of course, one of the other things you'll want to notice here is you can, instead of creating your own, you could choose from the pre-selected or saved list of monitors. You see the one we created here together. You can also go out by an import from Thwack. Now, when you go to Thwack, these are actually all of the different application templates that have been created, uh, created by users in the community or by our product management team and our development guys here for use within the Orion application performance monitor. And Orion APM is an application you'll want to use if you want to do monitoring of more than one Windows server, or if you want to do data collection over time, or really more robust style of monitoring than you get with a free tool. You can choose any of these from here and then simply choose to import those uh, right from within the application. Now once you've created your own, you can also go in and share those with other members on Thwack by exporting directly to the community site from the application. The WMI monitor is a great application. I've used it quite a bit here in the office today. It's been a lot of fun to play around with and test and monitor some of my servers. But again, if you want to do more holistic monitoring, you want to monitor you know, lots of different application servers, think about the Orion application performance monitor. You can download both the, the WMI monitor and a free copy of the Orion application performance monitor to run for 30 days from SolarWinds.com. Thanks a lot. Have a great day.